Okay guys, so I am back today and today we're going to be doing a little bit of a lifestyle video. So I went to Rite Aid being my regular old self and every time I go on Rite Aid I just can't seem to possibly walk out of Rite Aid without acquiring something or getting something that either I don't need, I don't, um, I did not come in there for but regardless it always happens I'm sure I'm not the only one that this happens to so anyway I came across the as seen on TV section which is me and hubby's favorite section in the store and came across this pot and of course I needed a new one it's not really a pot it's kind of like a frying pan as we say um, and I wanted to get it so I actually bought it and right now I'm in the process of trying it for the first time to see if it actually works so I figured I would take you guys on this journey with me you guys get to see a little bit of one of the dishes that I usually make on a regular like you know somewhat weekly basis and at the same time we can really try this out do a first impression but instead of a first impression for makeup it's gonna be for houseware so that falls under the lifestyle category so I figure this would be a good thing to share with you guys so we're gonna get right into it right now but of course subscribe if you haven't subscribed give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more household or lifestyle stuff like this and yeah let's get into the video all right so this is the non-stick frying pan and as you can see it basically has everything on there that it says that this is supposed to do I'm um, not really gonna go ahead and read that you guys can practically see but the main thing that sticks out to me is that it's a triple layer non-stick granite stone with titanium and diamond infused don't know what half of the stuff in the yellow really means but non-stick come on we kinda get that so gonna put this to the test I'm really going to see if this actually does what it's supposed to do what it's supposed to do um, also it's a few things I like um, you can use metal utensils in it most times when you have pots like this you can use metal utensils Two, it's oven safe up to 500 degrees um, it has um, it actually has a metal it has a metal handle so that's always a good thing so makes it easier to go in the oven um, yeah and the handle stays cool so those are very big things when it comes to getting pots and stuff for the kitchen you really want to look into things like that so and it says no oil or butter needed we're going to see so uh, let me just unwrap everything and then I'll be right back alright so Pot is out of the cardboard. I'm gonna turn the stove on. Not sure what heat I should do, but what heat setting, but I'm just gonna leave it on this setting right here. And I don't know if I should make it get hot first. It doesn't really say. I was trying to look at the instructions to see. So Right here, I have some ground turkey, which is 93% lean, which is mostly what I go for when I'm buying turkey. So I'm gonna put that in there. Now we're going to use a spoon in here. And I'm going to use my favorite. And put down over here. And so yeah, that's like marinating. Look at that. Good. Well, it looks like so far it's not sticking. Hey. So 
definitely fogging up my camera a little bit. Not sticking so far. So, best seasoning ever invented. Gonna use the Mbadia Tropical version. And we're just going to Okay, I think we need the other side. So, gonna sprinkle that in there. I think that should be enough. Look at how great that looks. This is like one of my go to things to make. Especially if I'm like on somewhat of a diet. Um, but I think it's really not sticking. I'm impressed. I don't know, this might be crystal approved after all. We'll see. So far, it's doing really good. So, this one really matches this down because I don't want it to be like too clumpy. I want it to be nice and finely chopped in there. So, I'm sure you guys get the gist of what I'm doing. So, I'm just gonna obviously these pink areas right here have to get brown like the other areas. So, just gonna let that sit up for a while and I will be. Alright, so this is what we got so far. Just added some. Dude, my focus is horrible. Added some um, Athenol's crumble feta. I'm trying this new flavor, which is the Mediterranean herb. Most times I usually just use the regular feta, the original, but you know, I'm wanting a little bit of kick this time, so. Doing that. So this number, this is just ground turkey, the um, badia seasoning. I also added some cumin um, and some cayenne pepper, and then I added the feta cheese in. So as you can see, there's like really no pinkness anymore. It's all brown. So this is practically ready, but I like to take this leave it just to really like get soaked up in there. So usually I eat this um, as my meat and sometimes I eat this as an actual meal, nothing else. But you could pair it with like a salad, you could pair it with like some veggies on the side or something. Anytime I don't want to eat like any carbs or anything like that, then I go with this and some vegetables, which can go wrong. So yeah guys, it's looking like this this pot is really doing what it's saying. I don't really know too much about the whole granite and like the type of material the pot is made out of, but I can tell you that for someone who cooks on a regular basis, this definitely is a non-stick pot, which I'm loving very much. As you guys saw, I didn't add anything. I didn't move them straight into the pot, so it definitely does do what it says, so you definitely don't need to add any oil or butter to get it to, um, you know, to, before you put your stuff in here. Um, the handle is actually cool at this moment. It's not getting hot, so that's another plus. I would definitely have to try this in the oven to see how good it is as far as the oven safe um, aspect of it. But so far, I'm pretty impressed with this. Like, this is pretty good. I mean, I just really like products to like actually do what it says on there and this one actually does you know prevent your stuff from sticking which is great because you know when you have something like this you don't want it sticking on the bottom of the pot like it defeats the whole purpose so yeah so this is definitely crystal approved so if you know you're looking for a nasty pot or a saucepan or whatever this is definitely going to work, or a frying pan, this will definitely work, as you can see it doesn't fit any of your stuff, and I'm pretty sure it doesn't really matter what you put in here, it's going to react the exact 
same weight. So, yeah guys, so this is my lunch for what Mara drinks for us. Thanks for tuning in with me on this little new aspect <laughs> of this video. Um, but yeah, definitely because they do definitely work. So, yeah, I would advise you if you need a non stick soft pen, go ahead and provide it in the Asian TV section. This is only $20. So it's a very good bargain. You can get it, and at least now you know it does what it says, so you don't have to worry. Alright, guys, so much time for bed. I will talk to you guys on the next video.